Hi everyone, this is Beth Buehler with Hope Unlimited, where we help overwhelmed professionals excel. Today's two-minute hope hint is on the topic of planning for the transitions of our day. When we make appointments on our calendar, we often don't think to remember that getting someplace or getting settled someplace can take 5, 10, or 15 minutes. Let's say you work downtown and you have to park a distance away and there's a five minute walk to get to your office. Then you have to take off your coat, boot up your computer, check your voicemails. There may be several things that you do before you really settle in to work on a project. So if you only allow yourself a 30 minute commute to get settled into work but it really takes 30 minutes just to drive there, you're not really planning correctly to help yourself breathe well and start your day most productively. One of the things that has been helpful to me when I'm faithful to do it is to do uh, allow for transition time in my mind when I'm returning from being out and doing errands or having meetings or, or other things. Uh, to have a staging area at home where I can dump everything that I've collected for the day and then begin to sort through it and put things away, say if I've stopped at a store, put items away, check through maybe the mail that I've picked up, and then uh, also replenish things like check my purse, clean out my wallet from receipts and coins, make sure that um, items I may have used are replenished, and just be ready for the next time I need to grab my bag and purse and go. That transition of even five minutes can make a huge difference in being prepared for the next day or the next time I go and keep things running a little smoother. So plan for those transitions and make them work for you. I hope you'll visit BethButler.com regularly for more tips like this, and I thank you for listening. Have a great day.